Welcome to my channel. Before we get into this vlog, I am collabing with artist Miss Yeezys. They sent me a pair of shoes and I'll be unboxing them with y'all. A very popular trendy pair of shoes. They are the red and black Jordan ones that just came out recently, Air Jordan ones. Y'all, everything on this shoe is literally like the exact shoe. Literally everything. I didn't compare it. I didn't went on the website. Literally everything. They are very affordable, very cheap, very nice for birthday gifts, Valentine's gifts, literally up to you. You can shop with them. Everything will be in the description box. This is that pair of shoes will be in the description box. Literally everything. As well as my discount code. You can use my discount code to get money off. They also have more shoes, different styles. Literally whatever you can think of they have, y'all. I'm definitely glad to be collabing with them and that they sent me this free pair of shoes. Their website will be in the description box. I will be showing y'all how the other shoe looks as well. Now on this shoe it has this little Jordan man attached to the shoestring lace part. And I believe this is on the original shoe as well. Like y'all look at that. Very good quality. Very very good quality. Also you do have to lace the shoes up on your own. Um, and this is how the bottom looks. Very good quality literally y'all. It's like a hit or miss. I definitely like them. Definitely recommend. Definitely will be sporting them. Popping out with them with a busting ass outfit. So yes y'all. As I said before you can't use my discount code. Everything will be in the description box. Literally everything. Now let's get right into this video. channel welcome to my channel y'all it is monday it is a new week new start of the week new fresh everything new week um i am getting over a cold so you know i am back outside back doing my you know daily routines daily stuff because i honestly been held up in the hostage in the house haven't been doing nothing literally so today i need to go get some soap some dry towels um make a hair store run grab some little stuff from the hair store just run a couple errands, get some food. Uh, I'm tired of eating soup. I want to eat something different. You know, shit like that. So, that's my plans. I don't know what I'm wearing today. I did my hair last night. So, it's kind of messed up because I just slept on it. But I'm finna get cute. Do something productive for myself. I'm looking for somebody to make me a YouTube intro so I can have me a new intro. You know, a new year, new intro. You know, new look. Even though I love the intro that I have. But I just want to, you know, look at something different when my videos come out. Or, like, let y'all see something different when my videos come out. And somebody texted me talking about seventy dollars for intro. Like, girl, I don't know who y'all think I am. Sit here in my bed and make it myself for free. You know what I'm saying? I didn't want to make it myself, or I would have already did that. Intros and outros really only worth thirty, twenty-five, if even that. I don't know. I had people trying to get over on other people or trying to get back on people. Like, what the fuck? But that's that. Kind of want to go have some breakfast, go to IHOP, because y'all know me. Your girl love IHOP, and I haven't had IHOP in a while. But I don't know. We're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see.
Okay, y'all, so I am outside for my meals. Like a baby Walmart that got everything except food, basically. But I'm gonna go in here and find me something. I wanted to buy a suitcase, but I'm not gonna buy a suitcase yet because I don't leave until next month. So, well, tomorrow is next month. But I'm not gonna buy me a suitcase yet. Um, I do not like these eyelashes. Like, I fucked up my eyelashes, y'all. I end up sleeping in my eyelashes, and now I just don't like the way they look. But finally at the house, I'm dressed. I got on this little, I got on this little shirt that I got from Five Below that I cut and tie, and then I got on some jeans with some um, Air Force Ones. Dollar Tree right here next door, so I probably go in Dollar Tree. I don't know. I'm trying to think of all the stuff that I need. I know I need some new foundation, but I'm not feel like going all the way to Target. Like that's the whole opposite way. But I do want IHOP, so if I do go to Target, then I'm gonna go give me some IHOP. But basically, I'm gonna go in here and give me some soap, some um, drying towels, you know, stuff like that. I wasn't gonna get a suitcase, but I'm gonna wait to get a suitcase. Um, I'm gonna come back, run me up a blunt, pull up somewhere, do me a smoke session video. That's pretty much it. Like, Okay, y'all, so I'm about to go inside. I just got thrown off, but. Okay, y'all, so I just left Foreman Mills. Why I'm leaving Foreman Mills? Why, why I'm in line? And the bitches in front of me act like they just don't hear the lady saying next, next, next. Like, girl, come the fuck on. What the fuck is y'all doing? People ain't got time to be way on the next motherfucker. And the store was taking forever. Like, what the fuck? She's saying, the lady behind the counter screaming, next, next. For the next person to come, and she's just sitting there. Like, what the fuck? It did not have no soap that I like. Why the men inside the store were trying to talk to the girl behind the counter? And she was like my age, like 19, 20. And he, um, the man, he was just being perverted as a bitch. Like, write your number down on the receipt. And like, man, if you don't leave this girl alone and go about your damn business and get the fuck out the store. Okay, y'all, so they got the soap that I wanted after walking around this fucking store like 10 times. Then I got these because I want to try them. I'm coming out of Walgreens, and this is man. I don't know if y'all can even see him back there. But he's sitting there, like, he damn near made me get him some change. Like, I'm trying to get some from the store. Can you please give me some? Like, damn, I don't even have no cash, bro. Car only. That's why I been keeping car only because people be asking for shit and knowing that they don't even be needing shit. Knowing he's not damn near not even homeless, only just want to go get some shit. I'm finna go wash my clothes, my bin, and fell over, all that type of shit. It's so much traffic, and it's only what? Oh, it's 3 o'clock, so it's before, that's why. Okay, y'all, so I had went to Walgreens and got me some soap. This is my favorite soap to use, literally, like, favorite soap to use. Then I got these organic cotton tampons because I've seen them on Facebook, and people said that they worked wonders, so I want to try them myself and see we know what was the hype about. I also ended up getting some Always Wipes. This is my first time seeing Always Wipes, so I figured why not try these as well. Basically, just picking up shit, buying shit, literally. I'm not supposed to be going on a no spin. And then I bought this little half crop top jacket. I got in a size large, but I don't think that shit is really a large. Then I got a 3 for 10 drying towels. This is really what I really wanted to go out and get. I don't know. Buying stuff like this really excites me, y'all. So I you know. I cannot wait to decorate my apartment. But I had got a 3 for 10 drying towels. Very cute. Very simple. Very colorful. Okay, y'all. So this is like days later, literally. Literally the worst at vlogging. I've been trying to like vlog and give y'all different shit like different shit to look at but i don't really do nothing um i want to start a new vlog today you know like a get ready with me um go to have breakfast with me a smoke with me or go pick out new makeup just some different shit some shit that i want to do you know get a break a breath of fresh air not only that i let my blunt on the wrong side it really just pissed me off i really, really just let my blunt on the wrong side but y'all But I know y'all love my session, so I figured let me come on here and give y'all a little smoke session before I end out this vlog. Um, this really was just like a day in my life vlog, really. I didn't do much. I just did a couple errands, you know, bought a couple things that I needed, went and washed my clothes, you know, simple shit. I 
I want it to be a go get a year, a go do a year, book a flight, go do it. You know what I'm saying? So that's another reason why I was down with it, ready to go do it. But at the end of the day, if I knew motherfuckers was going to cancel or wasn't going to follow through with the plan, I would have never, you know, came. I would have never brought myself in. I would have never brought my subscribers in. So now I'm back looking for people to come to Atlanta. Um, So far, it's four of us. I'm looking for at least two more people. But it's just the principle. I hate playing this shit with people. Like, I don't know. I'm just over it. Some people is just meant to go out. Some people is meant to travel. Some people is meant for this. Some people is meant for that. Just different people for different shit. I also want to tell y'all, I had went and did a photo shoot in my last vlog, as y'all seen. And a boy, he was being real secretive on his location and shit like that. I was sharing my location with my boyfriend, whatever. He got my location, so he know where I'm at. Long story short, the dude went from, I want to take your pictures. I, I basically want to be your cameraman, like how Ari and Jaden them got their cameramans, like when they go out. He basically wanted to grow with me, expand with me. Basically, like, make a team. But the nigga got to talking about being my style nigga and doing this and that. Like, just so much other weird shit. And... For one, when a motherfucker telling you, no, I'm not on it, I just want to take pictures, and you still trying to, just think about it, just think about it, that right there is a uncomfortable, now nah, I don't even want to take pictures with you, now nah, I don't even want to be in your presence, you get what I'm saying? I feel like you cannot mix business with pleasure. Like, a lot of dudes that do content shit, you know, like, shit, so much shit just be sexualized, I'm gonna just say that. Like, now I can't even get comfortable with you and take pictures in lingerie or you know a valentine's day shoot whatever the case is because now you done made me uncomfortable and not only that you know i got a boyfriend i'm in a relationship and you still trying to push yourself up on me you know what i'm saying i just don't like niggas like that niggas like that gives no cool points literally but that's that now i'm back looking for a photographer because as i said before in my girls video i wanted to do some photo shoots i wanted to expand i want to do different shit so i'm back looking for a photographer y'all also, if y'all hear, like, some noise in the background, that's because the house next door had caught a fire a couple days ago, and now they back fixing it, they working on it. So, if you hear, like, some noise, like, hammering or whatever, that's what that is. But, y'all, I just want to do a little small test with y'all. I'm not going to speak too much on my personal life, but a lot of y'all was saying I should start a YouTube channel with my boyfriend. And I'm very, I'm not secretive on who I talk to, but as y'all can see, we was talking for a year, and I was very secretive. And... I feel like once you show a motherfucker or you do something with a the motherfucker, they always prove you wrong or they always show you something different. And I be hating that shit. So from here on out, if it ain't a ring on this finger or if I'm not pregnant or if I'm not, you know, something like that, I'm going to just keep my love life to myself. You know what I'm saying? That's that. I know y'all probably wondering, me and my boyfriend is on good terms. I was just letting y'all know, you know, basically telling y'all. I probably would do a couple more videos with him, but I will not be making a channel with him until I feel, you know, it's the time. I just don't feel like that's necessary at this moment. Because I ain't got time for the bullshit. I ain't got time to be deleting videos and deleting channels, you know what I'm saying? That shit for the birds. I'd rather just do my own thing you do your own thing and that's just that and i'm the type of motherfucker to where i ain't gonna say i need reassurance but i need to make sure that we on the same level we got the same understanding to where we ain't got a second guess on each other we ain't got a mm, or i don't want to you know what i'm saying like that shit for the birds i'm only 20 and if i want you and i want to be with you that's what i want to do you know what i'm saying i could go talk to whoever the fuck i want to go talk to i could go talk to so many rappers and whoever the fuck am i dm like literally One of my subscribers invited me to Miami for her birthday um, in, what, two weeks from now? And I am going. As I told y'all, I'm always down to kick it with y'all and meet y'all. I'm just all down for new vibes, new people. You know, females that be on what I be on, that like to get cute, smoke, take pictures. You know, just all different shit. Like, I don't know. Females here don't be on what I be on. And it's crazy that I'd rather travel and go kick it and meet my subscribers then kick it with females here and travel with females here like so y'all this is the end of the video hope y'all enjoy as much as i enjoy making don't forget to like comment subscribe and on the road to 50k you already know the vibes go follow me on instagram and on tiktok and i will see y'all in my next video